Space-time modification weapon. A series of bizarre patents filed by the U.S. Navy has revealed a glimpse into the future of warfare. One of the most intriguing of these inventions is the space-time modification weapon, or SMW, a device claimed to make the hydrogen bomb seem like a mere firecracker in comparison. The SMW concept was first found in a Navy slide deck marked for official use only, obtained through a 2021 Freedom of Information Act request. The slides were part of documents detailing the U.S. Navy's experiments with the inventions of Dr. Salvatore Cesar Pais, a mysterious aerospace engineer. The slides mention the SMW as a potential application of the plasma compression fusion device, one of Pais's strange patent filings with the U.S. Navy. At the heart of Dr. Pais's inventions lies the Pais effect, a theoretical physics concept involving the controlled motion of electrically charged matter through accelerated spin and vibration. This effect, Pais claims, can generate immensely powerful electromagnetic energy fields capable of manipulating the fabric of reality itself with potential applications in propulsion, quantum communications, energy production, and weaponry. One such application is the plasma compression fusion device, which was detailed in a patent filed by Dr. Pais in 2018. Unlike most fusion reactor designs that rely on magnetic confinement, this compact device employs the Pais effect to generate the high magnetic fields needed to contain and compress fuel gases, such as deuterium or deuterium xenon, within a hollow plasma chamber. According to the patent, this device could produce power in the gigawatt to terawatt range, with input power merely in the kilowatt to megawatt range, a staggering claim, considering that one terawatt is equivalent to the output of a thousand nuclear power plants operating at full capacity. The Navy's documents suggest that under the right conditions, the plasma compression fusion device could lead to the development of the space-time modification weapon, capable of achieving extremely high energy levels through an effect described as a Z-pinch with a fusion twist. While the tests conducted thus far have neither confirmed nor disproved the existence of the Pais effect, the Navy's continued pursuit of these inventions suggests a belief in their potential to revolutionize energy production and weaponry. Craft using an inertial mass reduction device Among the most intriguing inventions from Salvatore Pais and the U.S. Navy is the inertial mass reduction device, a concept with the potential to revolutionize aerospace technology and transform our understanding of reality itself. The inertial mass reduction device, as described in the patent, aims to manipulate quantum field fluctuations in the local vacuum energy state, creating a polarized vacuum around a craft. This manipulation would effectively reduce the craft's inertia, enabling it to achieve extreme speeds and remarkable maneuverability in air, water, or space. Patent illustrations hint at a diamond or triangle-shaped craft, reminiscent of the black triangle UFOs frequently sighted in the 1990s. Alongside this, Dr. Pais's patents include a gravitational wave generator designed to produce high-frequency gravitational waves, which were first detected in 2016 following the collision of two black holes. By harnessing these waves, this device could create a vacuum bubble around a craft, propelling it at incredible speeds while maintaining stealth capabilities. Documents obtained through the Freedom of Information Act suggest that the Navy's interest in these patents may be fueled by reports of similar advancements pursued by the Chinese military. Although the existence of these patents does not confirm the successful development of the technologies, some evidence indicates that operability demonstrations have been conducted. Other released documents reveal a Navy Admiral's approval of the patent for the craft, powered by an inertial mass reduction device, noting that, quote, the next step is a working model. Despite the scientific community's division over the feasibility of Dr. Pais's inventions, critics argue that the energy required for the described field and electromagnetic propulsions far exceeds current technological capabilities. Navy officials seem to take the invention seriously. The Navy Air Warfare Center Aircraft Division has invested hundreds of thousands of dollars in projects related to Dr. Pais's work and is conducting experiments to validate the underlying concepts. Plasma Ghosts Not all military patents focus on weapons of destruction. One notable patent, filed in 2018 by Pentagon scientists, introduces a non-lethal weapon and defense system designed for crowd control and other non-violent interventions. As part of the Joint Non-Lethal Weapons Directorate program, the Laser-Induced Plasma Effect Project has been investigating methods to incapacitate adversaries from a distance without causing fatalities. A key patent describes a device capable of generating plasma for various applications, 
The patent details how directed energy produces a powerful laser that forms a plasma ball. In theory, directed energy could generate heat, warming an adversary's skin to uncomfortable levels without causing burns. Alternatively, it could drill microscopic holes in the skin, inflicting severe pain without lasting harm. One primary application of this plasma technology, which can be mounted on vehicles, is to divert heat-seeking missiles from their intended targets. The patent explains that a device mounted on an aircraft's rear creates a plasma filament with an infrared signature that mimics the target, thus luring the missile away. Additionally, plasma can be used to create 3D images in the sky, referred to as plasma ghosts, which could potentially explain some UFO sightings. The exact method for creating these plasma ghosts remains a closely guarded secret, but the patent asserts its feasibility. A plasma ball can also transmit sounds, conveying sound waves to deliver disconcerting and confusing noises that halt enemies in their tracks. Recent advancements include tweaking the high and low frequency sounds emitted by the lasers to mimic the human voice, enabling the issuance of commands and warnings. Theoretically, such a plasma ball could pass through materials like glass and appear inside a building. Although the technology is currently limited in this aspect, with sufficient power, a plasma ball might be able to pass through any solid substance. Black Triangle John St. Clair's triangular spacecraft, patented in 2004, may not have been developed by the military, but its patent notes potentially significant defense applications. This design incorporates vertical electrostatic line charges at each of its three corners, generating a horizontal electrical field. When combined with an antenna array, this field produces a force capable of powerful propulsion. St. Clair, a prolific patent holder, is known for his seemingly outlandish creations. Among his numerous patents are several classified by the patent office as unconventional propulsion systems. One such invention is a full-body teleportation system, which utilizes what St. Clair describes as a pulsed gravitational wave wormhole generator system, enabling human travel through hyperspace. While these ideas may sound like science fiction, they have likely caught the attention of military researchers. Photographic evidence suggests the military has tested a similar craft in recent years, dubbed the TR-3B. This aircraft reportedly employs a propulsion system akin to St. Clair's designs. Officially, the TR-3B does not exist, and some speculate that it was reverse-engineered from a UFO, equipped with an anti-gravity drive capable of previously impossible aerial maneuvers. The TR-3A, its predecessor, was first sighted in the 1990s. The TR-3B, also known as the Black Manta, is believed to be faster, quieter, and unlike anything seen before. Perhaps St. Clair's patents are not as absurd as they first appear. History shows that ideas once deemed outrageous can eventually become reality. It stands to reason that today's seemingly ridiculous concepts could revolutionize and define the battlefields of tomorrow. Still Secret While some military patents are released to the public in the usual manner, others remain hidden. To protect state interests, the Invention Secrecy Act ensures that certain patents stay concealed, leaving the public in the dark about numerous innovations. When a technology is deemed critical to the nation's economic or national security, the Invention Secrecy Act allows those patents to be filed under secrecy orders. Every patent application undergoes a manual screening process, assessing its broader implications for the United States. The Act's precursor emerged in 1917, during World War I, but it was cancelled at the war's end. Anticipating involvement in World War II, the U.S. reintroduced the Act in 1941. It became the Permanent Invention Secrecy Act in 1951. Early inventions covered by the Act included advancements in nuclear warfare. Beyond military projects, the government can impose secrecy orders on privately funded inventions, halting their progress if deemed a security threat. Violating a secrecy order results in imprisonment. Notable examples include a radar communication system, stifled from 1969 to 71, with the inventor receiving no damages after a 1982 court case. Between 2000 and 2008, an Alabama man was bound by a secrecy order for an anti-stealth system, also without compensation. As of 2017, nearly 6,000 patents were concealed by secrecy orders, sparking speculation about the details of these secret projects. Many likely pertain to warfare technologies, including vehicles, weapons, and defense systems. The Invention Secrecy Act remains a contentious issue. Some argue it embodies a Cold War mentality and should be abolished, 
while others support the government's right to keep certain secrets from both citizens and international adversaries. Which of these secret military patents will see combat within the next 10 years? Let me know in the comments. As always, thank you for watching Dark 5. Like and subscribe to continue exploring the greatest mysteries of this world and beyond.